Uh, interesting. Yeah, I'm gonna go with interesting. This is a very interesting week for sneaker releases. Let's start the show. <laughs> Welcome to the Heat Check. I am your host, Jacques Slade. And one of the bigger releases this week actually happened yesterday. Adidas dropped the Cookies and Cream edition of the Ultra Boost. The prominent upper looks good, as does that painted over boost midsole. Those are $200. You can grab them over at Finish Line. Jumping ahead to Thursday is when things really get started with some special LX versions of sneakers for the ladies. First up is the Air Max 95, one of my favorite Air Max models ever. And they will be dropping in Dusty Peach. The upper on these look really nice and you can grab those for 170. And not to be left out, the Air Max 97 is getting the LX treatment as well and really looks just as nice as the 95. That pair will cost you 170 as well. And while we're talking about the ladies, we might as well keep it going with the Air Jordan 1. Though this isn't your everyday ordinary Jordan 1, the brand has spruced the model up with some ladies only action and added a zipper to the front of the shoe in replace of the laces and tongue. The look is definitely interesting and the Nike Air tag on the side just looks crazy. Those will cost you 150. March has officially started, which means March Madness is on the horizon and Jordan Brand is getting in the game early with a few different models. The newest of the trio is the Air Jordan 32 Low. Dressed up in the colors of the Wolverines, this pair is probably my favorite of the weekend. Not that I'm a Wolverines fan, I just really like this colorway. Those are 160 over at Finish Line. If you're looking for something a little more budget friendly, but still want to rep your squad, the Westbrook Why Not 0.1 is dropping in the Georgetown colorway, complete with the logo over the shroud. These look to be the most limited of the bunch, and Finish Line will be selling these pairs at select stores for $125. I suggest reaching out to your local spot if you want a pair. And finishing up the Jordan Brand Trio is the Air Jordan 32 in the U.S. C colorway. The Air Jordan 2 inspired signature shoe looks great in that university blue and I really like the pattern the designers used on that midsole. Those will cost you $185 over at Finish Line as well. <laughs> Nike is mixing up a few styles this weekend creating some new looks and it all kicks off with the Nike Court Vapor. Well, Technically, it's the Nike Court Vapor and the Air Max 95, and they're being mixed together for a special version for Roger Federer. Nike is just calling the shoe Neon as a nickname, which is an obvious nod to the original colorway of the 95. Those will cost you 180. If you're more of an Air Max 97 type of person, you'll be happy to know that the model is getting an updated outsole thanks to the Nike Vapor Max. We've seen this approach quite a bit over the last few weeks, and I think it works for certain models. The Neon colorway seems to be the trend this month, and you can grab this updated hybrid silhouette for $190 starting on Friday. All right, for Saturday, we get two signature sneakers over at Finish Line. The first pair is the Retro from Jordan Brand and introduces the Air Jordan 9 in a very sleek colorway of black and red. While both of these colors obviously have a big influence on the Jordan line, this black upper pops a bit more than usual. Those will cost you 190. For the second signature shoe, we get the pair that probably belongs to this year's MVP, James Harden. James has been balling this year and his new silhouette is just starting to really make the rounds after that All-Star Weekend introduction. Dressed in silver, you can grab those over at Finish Line as well for $140. So that's going to do it for the show today. As always, I just wanted to cover the things that I thought you guys would definitely care about. Make sure you check the links down below for more information on all the sneakers that I mentioned in the video. I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line. And as always, guys, I appreciate you. I'll see you soon. Peace.